And of course, this product for 30 years has always been everything free. You know, we yeah. still get asked, um, is the Saccharomyces yeast okay with Candida? The answer is yes. Yeah, you know, um, yeast is also a superfood. It's really yeah. a microscopic, single-celled herb. Mm. That's really what yeast is. And it's been used for thousands of years it, when it grew naturally and also people grew it all over Europe, especially a part of traditional totally. European uh, medicine. The specific proprietary yeast that I use is absolutely non-fermentable. Yes. We heat it just high enough to destroy yeah. any activity, but not high enough to destroy the B vitamin very, very content. Pointed. And if you want to talk B vitamin Super B Three vitamins. Degrees. You're talking nutritional yeast and also like spirulina, like chlorella, like blue green algae. Nutritional yeast is a single cell plant, which means it assimilates right in your mouth, mm. in your tongue, mm. in seconds mm. into your bloodstream. And that's one of the things we want with superfood is to get it in the bloodstream and get ten it in seconds. fast. I always say 10 seconds, you'll feel better. Exactly. And you do. Exactly. It's, so it's no really worries quick. about the yeast at no, all. No, it's, it's, it's fine with candida and, right. and all that. That's right, absolutely. And then the other question, of course, we get, is it gluten-free because there's, there's grass in it? A lot of people, you know, wheat is, yeah. a, is, a, is, a, is a grain that has been degenerated in America yeah. for the last 50 years. All wheat that exists today in America all the wheat is now not natural wheat. Mm -hmm. It's high gluten garbage. Mm. And this is why it makes people fat. Ew. This is why we have so much problem with yeah. obesity. And everybody's starting to realize they're yeah. having uh, uh, digestive uh, and physiological problems by consuming wheat. Mm -hmm. There is no wheat grain in superfood. Exactly. It is wheat grass. And there yeah. is absolutely no gluten in the grasses. Yes. There's alfalfa grass barley grass yes. and wheat grass, not grains, grass, yes. so that it is 100% gluten-free. I know that some gluten-free people have a problem with where it's grown, how it's grown, what time it's picked, how, exactly. how high it was, yeah, and you see and that the it contamination. Says made in a facility that may contain nuts That's and grains, it. not in our facility. Yeah.